Hello everyone, welcome back to Jim Ripley Music in my channel, I'm Teacher Theory. This video is all about fan playing time with your little ones and all the game activity in this video not only help your baby full body coordination and but also you can have a special bonding time with your little ones. So let's get started with our first activity. Are you ready? Let's go! First activity, ping pong catching. In this activity, we need some paper cups and the ping pong balls. We already designed our ping pong balls into the monster eyeballs to make the activity more fun. Firstly, the adult has to roll the ping pong ball one at a time and let our little one to catch it with the paper cups. You can also roll them a little bit faster or slower. And then scaffolding with two balls at a time. This fun activity will help your kid eye hand coordination and tracking of the moving objects. Second activity. Fun Animal Walk We will provide the paper cups, two or three balls, and two packets. This time, we will place the paper cups on the floor and let the kid walk over the cups with the spider walk first. At the end point, we will place the ball to pick up and change into the penguin walk. You can try those two or three times. Provide the packet to put the ball back for the neat finish. Your little one will develop full body coordination and this kind of activity will help their muscle control through play. Third activity, balancing blanket. We need the towel, all the blanket, play ball, and the bucket. Adults and kids hold each side of the blanket and put the balls on top of it. We will have the start and the finish line for the game. This kind of activity helps the kids concentration, sense of balance with motion, and they can also learn how to play as a team. Fourth activity, Pyramid Bowling. Here is another paper cups game. We need 21 paper cups to build the pyramid with the kit. Cap stacking has many benefits for cognitive development and targets specific areas of the body and the brain to increase intelligence, problem-solving skills, and good for their critical thinking. And for bowling, of course, we will use the play ball. Your little one will know how to aim the target accurately. This fun game will be the good practice for eye-hand coordination as well. You can provide some colored cups to learn the pattern and also do counting for basic mathematics skills. And you can also tell them when to aim for the strike row. Encouragement is the key for the kids to build their confidence. Hooray! Fifth activity, color steps. In this activity, we need two different color papers for each player. Start from the starting point and player can only step on the color papers. We have to move the color paper alternately to move forward to the finish line. Whoever reached the finish line first will be the winner of this game. And this will help the kid to develop in spatial awareness and problem solving skills. Don't forget to give a high five. Boom! Yay! Hooray! I hope you enjoyed this video. Thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe our channel. So we'll see you in the next video. Bye bye! Mwah.